One of the things you are going to find the last day is offense. And what does offense does? Offense makes you to stumble. You are offended with somebody. They now try to come and talk about the person. When you talk about that thing, you will stumble in your judgments. Your judgment is your conclusion about the thing. Be not be offended. It's not only to your brethren. What Satan has put outside you there is enough to hurt any man. So what you are fighting is enemy within and enemy without. You alone every day. Look at what you do to God. Don't think of anybody. You alone. Leave your wife and your husband. You, what you are doing to the Lord. And God is not offended. We will see a lot of Christians being hurt. And because they are hurt, they will become bitter against their government. Look at me. When you are bitter against your government, you can never be a pure fountain. We will profess with our mouth. Imagine we say we are looking for everlasting life, but we are bitter against government. You are going to grow up in that midst of contradictions. And that's why anybody that will please the Lord, that will walk of the Lord to please him, cannot be foolish. That will be wise spiritually. Very, very wise. You're able to know what Satan has set as a trap for us to fall victim of and defile us. You saw that in Jesus. Father, forgive them, for they don't know what they are doing. That thing, so that you won't stumble in judgment and you'll forgive. That's the only way you won't be offended. They can hurt you, it pains you, but you are not holding them. Those are commandments of faith that you have to keep. If truly they are going to sit upon the throne, Nothing must offend you.